Hello everybody and welcome on my YouTube channel. You are with uh, Alan Dries and today it's Friday. It's the day of uh, War of the Gods. So let's go for the fifth episode of Life Fight in War of the Gods. Like you can see uh, till uh, last week, uh, I did every day uh, my daily quest. So I'm now level uh, 18. My personal record, it's uh, 17 uh, one. I, I lost uh, one match. It's uh, less good than last season, but we will see uh, how it will be today. Let's begin my first match. Little long VIP uh, 13, so it's one opponent who has uh, all. It will be a little more interesting. I'm opening with a Tarot Prophet as usual, and I will see what he is doing. Okay, so Rose Fencer as first uh, hero, he will meet only man, so it's pity for him. So I will propose something like that, classical. But perhaps I will not put a uh, Turtle Fighter, I still don't know. It's, uh, it depends what he will propose for me. I will not pick uh, Turtle Fighter, definitely, so... I will do like that. Perfect, and that's sub, uh, sub, uh, what I will take. Hmm. Let's take Phoenix. So normally the matchup is for me, but we don't know uh, what can happen. Oh, Queen of Cures uh, totally destroyed. For this fight, in my opinion, it's a mistake to pick uh, Rose Fencer as first pick because if I don't pick any woman, his Rose Fencer is useless. You saw he did his ultimate, okay, he did his ultimate, nothing happened. I will even don't use my uh, sub for this fight. Uh, it's, uh, it's his fault, <laughs> if I can tell. Okay, finish. I show you the statistic of the fight. For sure, Rabbit did nearly all the job and uh, great damage for Griffin because I have a lot of clones. So, let's check uh, how we'll open the second fight. Turtle as first pick, so for the moment <laughs> I will propose him a beginning of a Master Mage. And now he already doesn't have a uh, Rose Fencer, who is one of the main counter for uh, my uh, Master Mage team. So he can win for sure because Turtle Fighter is also a good counter. Look at that. Turtle Fighter and Sorceress in the same team. I'm already happy because I'm nearly sure that I will win the match even if I lose this fight now. Okay, perfect. Let's see what can happen. The turtle plus sorceress in the same team, it's a big present for me. I lost. 
Nothing crazy, hein. this, uh, this matchup was not for me. And now I have my last fight. I have still my turtle fighter and my sorceress for this last fight. So I will begin, uh, you know probably that I will use a uh, sorceress so I will not hide uh, nothing. After that uh, I will play, for the moment I show him only this. It's not a surprise, so it's uh, not necessary for me to hide this arrow because he knows that I will use it. Oh, it's really strange pick. Okay. <laughs> I will not use a full undead. I will play like that and I will use this one. And as sub, I have a uh, Tarot Prophet in front of me and the clone, so I will use. Uh, Frost Mage will help me a lot. So I have possibility to lose because he has Rabbit. If Rabbit do a crazy grab, it will be uh, hard for me. But I have advantage definitively in this uh, matchup. <laughs> it's not. Uh, it's not really good for him because <laughs> he grab. Uh, what he mustn't do. And it's over. Like I was telling, he lost the match in two rounds. He didn't lose the match in this fight, he lost the match in two rounds. And you can check the statistic of the fight. He was uh, nearly without any chance uh, to win this fight. Let's uh, go to the second match. Second match, I'm now uh, level 19. Let's... Uh, See, VIP 8, server 67, so this opponent uh, doesn't have rabbit. It's important for me because I know when my opponent doesn't have rabbit and that I have rabbit, I have nearly one match who is already win. So I need just to win second match. Okay, so <laughs> this, most of the time, it will be a Vanguard Warrior team. So I will play Classical. I don't care about his Vanguard Warrior at all because I will use against this my uh, Turtle Fighter. So he can play with this. I don't care. I will know now. Yes, it's 100% uh, it's that. So it's perfect. And he used turtle. He used uh, sorceress, so I'm happy anymore. <laughs> okay, and uh, in sub, uh, pop, 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 uh, this one. So the matchup is for me another time. Huh? I can lose for sure. Always it's possibility to lose, especially when my turtle fighter don't go. But uh, the chance of uh, losing are really low. Yes, like I was thinking, no problem. Show the statistic. Uh, players are not using properly Vanguard Warrior. You don't open Vanguard Warrior team when you don't know what your opponent has and when it's the first fight that you are playing. It's a uh, it's mistake.
it's another time. What I was explaining in all this episode, if you are playing with your mind, when you know that you will play, for example, it's exactly what he's doing now, or for example, for me, I can play Vanguard Warrior in this, uh, in this position, and I will do it. And I will play uh, Special Vanguard Warrior, I will not commit all my heroes. Because I see already two tanks, so I know that I can use it. Or oh, what is this lineup? I don't uh, I don't understand. <laughs> Perhaps it will work. I don't know what is this team. And like I tell you, you mustn't have a lineup in your mind before the fight. Okay, you can know your best team, you can apply it in some condition. You see that I'm using a, a, a lot of time my Turtle Fighter team, but in my mind, it's not definite if my opponent do something who will be a problem for me, I will not use this team. And like you see in the first fight, if I see that my opponent play a, a low team, I will not use my uh, Turtle Fighter team against this. I don't need uh, to win. And uh, for this fight, um, top, I will do the same as him. Which against uh, against uh, Amber Blade, it's the same. It's no sense because Amber Blade is a natural counter of Witch. But why not? It can work. I don't know. Perhaps I will lose, but it's not normal. It's not a, a smart choice. Yes, the result is the result was sure on the paper 99% before the fight. You have uh, Ancient Protector who is horrible against uh, Amber Blade, and you pick okay at this moment he didn't know. And behind you pick a sub uh, witch when you know that your opponent has Amber Blade. It's another mistake. You mustn't do that absolutely. Let's uh, go to the third fight now. For the third uh, match, uh, let's uh, search. Known VIP server 117, so it will be hard for him, I'm sure. So I keep the same opening. And this opening is really good. If my opponent pick Vanguard Warrior, he's dead. If my opponent pick uh, Master Mage, he's dead. And if my opponent pick a Turtle Fighter, directly I have chance to, ch to adapt my team and to choose if I will do something or not. So, in this condition, uh, I will stay classical. And I keep in my mind that if this team won't be so strong, I will not put my Turtle Fighter. I have advantage. Oh, look, uh, against this, uh, I even don't want to put my, uh, my rabbit. I will not not put my rabbit against this, so I will play like that, and I will play uh, with, uh, where he is, uh, with Oz. Okay. You see, it's exactly the example of, about what I was speaking. I have my team in my head, it's true. I see this, I will not use a crazy strong team against this. I think I can win with uh, two heroes. Uh, it's a caricature, but uh, it's like that, so. Uh, there. No, 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 no. Hop. This one. I can't, I can't imagine, for example, that I can lose this match. <laughs> I don't know, but really, it should be really strange if I lose. <laughs> yes, 
heaven without my sub. So this team was uh, absolutely without any sense. And now I have still all my cookie cutter, except it Tarot Prophet, okay? Not, uh, not really a problem for me. What will do my opponent? For the moment, he's not playing. <laughs> Oh, perhaps he, he rage quit. Oof, yes, it's uh, it looks like a really strange pick. First pick, uh, so I will play uh, where it is. Uh, where is the arrows that I'm looking for? Is there? Yes, you see that uh, he's not in his, on, in, on his computer, sorry, because he has only 10 seconds of uh, match fight. So sorry, this match uh, won't be so, so interesting. Uh, okay, I will play like that. Ah, he came back. He came back, but <laughs> with this pick, now he will have some problem. Yes, he left the fight for sure. I'm sorry for this last fight. It was the War of God of the day. I will open uh, my chest. And I'm now uh, level uh, 20. Thank you everybody for watching this 5 episode of Life Fight in War of the God. I want to repeat one thing because it's really important. Please don't play in War of the God with pre-made team. It means if you go and tell in your mind, okay, I will play a Rose Fencer, a Tarot, blah, 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 blah. If your opponent has mind, he will counter you and you will, lost, uh, you will lose the fight without uh, any problem for him. Think, adapt your composition in according to the arrows that choosing your opponent because it's really interesting. This feature is crazy good for a strategy. It's the only one actually in the game who is really interesting as a strategy uh, maker. It's all uh, for today. Next episode uh, will be next week. I will be probably around Legend. I don't know uh, at this moment, but every day I'm playing free fight. So it's grown up uh, pretty, pretty uh, quickly. If you want to miss nothing about my actuality, you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter. You can also subscribe to my YouTube channel. And if you want to support my work, you can click on the last link on the screen. Thank you, guys. Bye bye.